happy with having two different games on the same console that have varying amounts of volume. Um, yeah, this stream I want to play around with a different party leader. I gotta learn how to play Dunban. Alright, there's a uh, friendship thingy up here. Not gonna lie though, I've seen a lot of ads for the Burger King uh, chicken sandwich. It's it's, uh, it's very tempting. Looks pretty good. I want cane. <laughs> I want the cane sandwich. Like I, I had it once, like a month ago. I'm, I'm like, <laughs> yeah, well, that was good, good, good sandwich. Even though it's just like three, three, uh, was it two? It was literally just chicken tenders and then a bun and pickle and like the sauce. But it, it was good. good. Good, good chicken. Good tendies. Yeah, the closest one is like near a mall around here, I think. Pretty far away from me. I do have a coupon though from Uber Eats that takes away like 20 bucks, so. I'll see what happens. I did. I ordered pizza on Friday and uh, I had put in instructions uh, to like leave the pizza at the door to have contactless delivery. But then the, the, the delivery dude got like lost and was on the wrong street. So, you know, I put no no contact, no no contact, please. I had to do some social interaction, get my pizza. First world problems. Same thing kind of happened like the other day as well, like two weeks ago. When I ordered McDonald's. Uh... Do like do you put the contact contactless delivery, just leave that door. And yet the dude still called me, and I was like, I called back like, hey, what happened? I'm like, oh yeah, I, I just forgot that you put the note for contactless delivery. I'm like, oh okay, thanks for the food. Anyways, we're in a crotch, so there's a bunch of poison all over the place. <laughs> A joke in here. I've never seen very low hanging like fruit. This. You see, this is why I've been saying you need to get out of the lab every now and then. We're aiming to get inside the Bionis. We can get to the upper regions from there. Wow, I've never thought about going inside the Bionis. The closer we get to the top, the more monster trouble we're gonna run into. The only things I venture this far in are the Nopon merchants. And curious types like me. You really know all the fun spots, eh, Dixon? Oh. <laughs> you want to get to the top? Then this is the only way. We'll push on, no matter what. That's the spirit, Shulk. Upa, upa. Bugs? I already need to upgrade Gale Slash. It's like you're using a lot of combos. Ace, walk through the totally not diseased water. One fight. I 
pretty weird how uh, the, the whole race of humanity is just living. Oh no, they're, they're not. They're, I guess the Halms. Uh, just living on top of a giant mech. It's a very interesting concept. It's like uh, if like those inner world theories were actually true. <laughs> I guess true in a video game sense. These people live on giant mechs? Yeah. Uh, we well, see the icon. We, we, we are on the mech. We started down here, on like the shin. We moved up the knee, the leg, top leg, inside the leg, and now towards the uh, torso. Trying to fight? Oh, you! Hey, it's already dead. Fighting, huh? These are like weird, like quadruple winged owls. Weird. That was decent. Maybe I should have used another move in it, but. Yeah. Oh. Just gonna sleep standing up real quick, don't mind us. It's kind of really weird. Everyone, look! It's a group of Nopon. Ah, some Nopon merchants. Mix. Well, that's what that's preposterous. Is you know, Blade 2, they live on giant flying beings the size of continents is on a sea of clouds. That's Let's logic right there. Them. Well, maybe this Good game idea. explains why. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe Xenoblade you know, Chronicles X explains why. Maybe. I don't know. I do have my Wii U. It's like the one Xenoblade game that's not been ported yet, so... Hey, if, uh, if there's never a Chronicles X Definitive Edition, I'll, I'll do that. Not anytime soon, though. <laughs> Maybe next year. We don't need 200 hour RPGs <laughs> back to back. I'm good. Shenmue, on the other hand, I, I want to play that this summer. Probably after this game. I've heard mostly bad things about X, but I still want to try it. I have heard nothing about it, so I do not know. This first time you come to Satori, says Satoru, this place covered in fog all year round. It's best not to move around at night time. Many, many bad things happen at night. It's so scary here. Detox brogs attacked me before and nearly gobbled me up. I do not want that to happen for again. He, he, he kill some, please. Yes. Just bring the Metro Prime Trilogy to, to Nintendo. 
three switch shoe stomps. Hey, I mean, on a Steam Deck, uh, you could put the Metroid Prime Trilogy on there and upscale it to like 1080p or something. Just, uh, just saying. <laughs> you ever see Sat Satoru Glow? You know, see, uh, you know, can't see in daytime, but you could see at nighttime. Trees give out beautiful light. This place is totally nice. But I hate cockapiece quad wings. Oh, that's what they're called. Cop, 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 whatever. They attack me when I make camp. I wish they would leave me alone. Can you kill some for me? Yes. Great, be careful. <laughs> Ever been to Baron Mole? Mr. Rogu's, they're so scary. They're not there at night. But no point I act in daytime so they see us. Then they attack us. Can you kill some for us? You're so kind. Now it's safe to move around at daytime. Oh gosh, another one. <laughs> Officer Wolf, so fierce. Always want to fight. Even tech in this camp. Bokoko chases them for, for me. Bokoko, old now. Not easy for Bokoko. Hey, you killed them for me? Yeah, there's been more rumors actually recently of um, apparently Metro Prime Trilogy for Switch is ready. But Nintendo is holding it hostage or something. I don't know. It's just every month we've been, or every year we've had the, the rumors of Prime Trilogy <laughs> coming out. Uh, oh well. Let me drop a solid 400 plus bucks. Let me get my card out, my private jet. I'll take the, the Buddha guy to make the trip faster. <laughs> Bugatti. <laughs> no what trouble. Hey, well, I mean, I, I'm, I'm getting the Steam Deck. Hopefully, the $400 model still has the M.2 upgrades so I could, like, drop another, like, 100 bucks and I'll have, like, a nearly a terabyte of extra storage or something. No, like half a terabyte, it'd be like a 400 SD card and a 256 M.2 or something, I don't know. I'll see. And I'm, I'm not worrying about that now. <laughs> I got my $5 deposit. No, no need to think about it for now. Somebody help. Bokobo need help. Ignace took Bokobo friend Kacha. If no one says Kacha, Ignace eat her. Are they like iguanas? That is indeed a problem. Agree more. Kacha is a scholar who knows lots about legends of this place. Okoko thinks Ignace take Kacha for information. But they know eat Kacha straight away, but Okoko is still worried. What could the iguanas poss possibly hope to learn from him? It must be about that big secret, but Okoko but Coco not know, know very much. Important secret, it sounds fascinating. The safety is top priority. Ignace took Kacha to ex Exile Fortress. We help Ka Kacha. Oh. Okay. There's a fortress here? But Okoko, I think it's too dangerous to go on to the front. So better to go on back door if you can. You need to find key to open back door. Alright. That sounds like a lengthy mission right there. Well, anyways, we have an enemy right here. Copish. Yeah, um, I was watching the uh, latest WAN show from LTT. And they were talking about the, the Friday one is obviously about uh, one of the main topics was the Steam Deck. And uh, Linus showed the nearest competitor, which is like 700, 800 bucks. And that thing is, uh, I think it has a stronger CPU, but the GPU and the Steam Deck is going to be much better. So, and he, Linus showed, he was playing uh, Mario Kart Wii on that thing. I was like, dang. I could play Mark Hart Wii on the go, <laughs> even though I'll probably just play it play on my computer. <laughs> but it's portable. No, um, in all seriousness, I don't know. I find it cool. Uh, which is partly why I want it. I, I like portable technology as well. It's always kind of fascinated me. See if I can't handle gaming ahead of its time. Yeah, that's why even more reason like to buy into it, you know. Like the uh, PSP Go, I 
I mean, I got mine super late. I got mine like two years ago at a pawn shop for like 60 bucks. Probably the best 60 bucks I could have spent. Because I love that thing, even though I haven't used it in a long time. It, the form factor is like amazing. It just fits in your jean pocket like nothing. Um, it just has pretty decent battery life. Its screen is pretty uh, pretty high quality. Uh, there's no UMD drive, which doesn't matter. What a, in a world of jailbreak broken PSPs, you know. So that thing is like wicked amazing. I think there is somebody that is making a, a an SD card adapter for it to go, which I want to buy at one point because I think it has 16 gigs on board. And you can guess that uh, it fills up very easily. <laughs> so, jeans pockets. Well, well, Mr. City Boy. I like my jeans. Like, literally, like the little like watch pocket that's in jeans, you could, you could fit a piece to go in there. Like, it fits in there perfectly. <laughs> I love it. My one complaint is the joystick, because I, I used the PSP Go to play Daxter like a couple years back. And that, that's where I played it on. And the analog was kinda annoying at times, but you, you manage, you get used to it. Kinda wear jeans all year round. I mean, actually year round, I just wear, you know, my jeans and a uh, white shirt, a uh, white undershirt and something, a uh, shirt up top of it. It's kind of my go-to year-round. If it's kind of cold, I have my hoodie on, you know? I like the cold. I can't wait for this fall, though. It's gonna be real chill. Especially with me, like, going in person in classes again. I think it's only gonna be, like, have, like, one, uh, online course. And one in person. That's, like, every Friday or something so I get, I get to walk to school once uh, once a week I should probably squeeze in more days though uh, I need to walk more often but I hate walking in the summer because I get uh, affected by heat pretty badly I don't notice it half the time which is kind of like the worst thing about it so I think I feel fine and then like, I come back home and like I notice like how red I am or like how uh like the bad heat I really was. I'm like, oh well then. Time to consume water. Summer sucks. It's already finished though. Oh crap. Oh. This is the power of unity, Charlotte. Not bad. Just like old times. Let's go. We fight. Maybe I should have broken defense before doing this. Oh well. Oh, there's more enemies popping in. Anything else really happened today? 
in any of the uh, in the real life or the virtual life. Hey, I got jury duty next week. I got a call and I gotta read the letter again to see when I got a call. Cause I really hope they don't really choose me. <laughs> I'm not gonna go if I don't have to, especially since the fact it's in like in the, like very early on in the day, 8 a.m. or something. Gotta be up, and I uh, not good, but uh, I'm not a morning person at all. But that was probably an easy thing to guess. 